All right, and let's go ahead and talk about this because Philadelphia has yet to see measurable snow this winter, but Minneapolis, well, they've already seen a surplus of powder. So we do want to break down the snow or in some cases the lack of so far, plus how much of it may be in the near future. It is time for another edition of Fox Weather Meteorologist Snowdown. Showdown, Snowdown, get it? We're here tonight, Fox 29 Philadelphia Meteorologist Kathy Orr, and we also have Fox 9 Minneapolis Chief Meteorologist Ian Leonard, both of us with us to take part as they are a part of the Fox Weather family. And uh, I'm excited to see what both of you have to say because, Ian, let's kick it off with you. We were talking to you about 24 hours ago before the snow started falling in the Twin Cities. So talk yeah. to us about this surplus mm -hmm. of snow. Last night, if I asked if you had a special dance, but I, I feel like there might be more to it. <laughs> well, there is the dance that helps, but you know, it's Minnesota, it's January. We're supposed to have snow, but we are in a surplus as of today with the fresh three point some inches of snow. We're topped out at 52.1 inches so far this season. That puts us as a top four season only to this point. Our average for the entire year is generally around 54 inches. And I don't think it takes much to realize that we're nowhere near the end of winter here in Minnesota. We're yet to get to our average cold this week, which by the way is next week and uh, one of our snowiest months which is February. So, of course, the challenge is mm -hmm. for people nationally to look at us and go, oh, hmm. no, 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 no. Right? There's somebody in Miami going, how do they live there? <laughs> well, you, you, you get the right gear. you got the boots, the pants. You've got heated gloves and some very big jackets, to which Kathy is probably, you know, gallivanting around in a little light coat at the shore saying, oh, it's great <laughs> in Philadelphia. We love it here. And I'm... And I'm sitting here going, yeah, this is, um, yeah, yeah. It's pretty. It's pretty. Yeah. It's we got a lot of snow. No, the snow envy is real. Uh, so, Kathy, I'm going to send yeah, it's it to pretty you. When, it's pretty when you're on that end. <laughs> no, I, I've got snow envy. I'm not even kidding. I love the snow. Bring it on. Kathy, what is happening in the city of brotherly love? It is lacking. It is lacking, and I do envy my friend Ian. Yeah, I mean, it's just rain. I mean, that's what's been happening. The whole pattern throughout the fall into the winter months has been either cold and sunny or warm and rainy. It started in September and it's still going. Now, typically we see everything kind of switch by January. If we go into January pretty mild, by the second half of the month, we switch the pattern. Hasn't happened so far in this La Nina year. Now consider this, we haven't had snow in nearly a year. 313 days. You have to go back to March 12th when we picked up four tenths of an inch. That was it. And that was all for the month of March as well. But now we are snowless. All we have had so far, Marissa, is a measly trace of snow. And that was on the 23rd of December. We were so hopeful for Christmas. <laughs> Nada. No. It's been depressing. Just a yeah, little it's, bit it's to, to satiate the craving. But I got to say, it's getting to the point where a lot of people in the Northeast are scrolling through their phone to look at what snow used to be like. You know, that ah, that nostalgic feeling. And I almost don't want to ask because it's getting annoying at this point. But, Ian, when are you going to see more snow? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know, here's the thing. I, if you want some snow, I'm more than happy to put some in a box and UPS it out to you <laughs> because we've got plenty to share. But you're a little envious of what's going on, my friends. You can't do this. Oh, Kathy, now he's just See, being We weird. can have fun in the snow. <laughs> you can only dream about the snow. We can lay in the snow. We can eat the snow. <laughs> as long as it's not yellow snow, we can just hang out in the snow. Don't do that. I'm, I am done with you. <laughs> Kathy, take over. Uh, what's coming your way? Yeah. Okay, well, give me some good I'm news done for the with Northeast. Him. <laughs> I'm done with him as well. Well, in Philadelphia, we know for at least the next 10 days, we're not going to be seeing any snow. It's going to be going to the north. And we actually could have another snowless record. February 3rd, 1995. February 3rd was the latest date of not getting any type of measurable snow. And we could break that record this year. Kind of a depressing wow. record. But we do know that through the Adirondacks, Whiteface Mountain, Lake Placid, one of my favorite places to ski, and into uh, the mountains of Vermont, Stowe and Killington, we know they're getting snow. So at least we're happy for them. Yeah, you know what? I got to say, a lot of people are saying, I don't want to clean off my car. I don't want to drive in it. I get it. Ian's still laying in the snow. Hey, Fox 29 Philadelphia <laughs> meteorologist Kathy Orr. We also have Fox 9 Minneapolis chief meteorologist Ian Leonard. Always fun. Catching up with you guys. Enjoy and make the best of whatever, whatever weather you got.
Thanks, Marissa. Thanks. Absolutely. We'll see you both later. <laughs> I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.